and welcome back, everyone. We've returned from the void beyond space and time in which our previous episode ended. And we are once again back in the corporeal realm. And now this may look a little bit familiar. And that's because this is just the... I had to replay the... Uh, the ch I had to actually replay the entire chapter. <laughs> to Because um, as we saw, just going back to a checkpoint wasn't enough to escape the dread realm of... I somehow found myself in. So I had to replay the whole chapter, and this is just, you're just catching the tail end of that again, of the uh, lead up to it. And hopefully this time we'll have better luck. Well, they're here this time, so. Yeah, and and this is post-commentary, so it's, I kind of actually already know. Spoiler <laughs> alert. All right. Trishka, not the biggest fan of, of, of Mr. Hunt, it seems. Oh, well, yeah. She de definitely doesn't like us. But, as you can see, notice now we're all on the dam together. I'm not sure precisely where I lost them last time, but... Well, it was definitely before the dam. Now we can, you know, make a nice family trip of it. <laughs> I joke, but I doubt... Gr it's probably the closest thing Gray has to family, really, is Ishii. Yeah. Ishii and those two interchangeable hicks he got killed. Doc and not Doc. Yeah. <laughs> I really forget his name and I feel bad. Railway. Railway is it. But oh, yeah, okay. I don't blame... And well, yeah, there. Ah, oh, and I'm blind. Well, oh. down, down he goes. Into the spikes. Yeah, those spikes aren't. This... this is what this area looks like when it's actually working. Yeah. I was actually a little surprised. You must be doing pretty okay at the game to uh, not notice that your companions aren't with you, because there's quite a few enemies here. Yeah, well, I can't claim to be especially good at it. And actually, I will say, the the AI companions in this are actually a lot more helpful than they are in a lot of games. Hmm. They actually kill enemies, they don't get in your way that much. Can Trisco whip? Uh, I don't think so. Hmm. Not that I recall. I, I don't see her doing... Although, again, m remember what I said about how this game really seemed to have been built for co-op until the last minute? Right. I'm guessing that in the, uh... She probably could, in the original version, if when you played co-op. Mm-hmm. We discussed that. Just as I suspected, like, in the early version... Because remember, as you pointed out, Grey is talk at one point talks to Ishii as if he had a leash. Yeah. And, like, we suspect that in the early version of the script, Ishii actually did. And there will be a, a, another person who joins our, our band for a while at one point, and they also have a leash. But they never use it. That's weird. Well, they actually do use... You actually do see them use it in a cutscene at one point as well. Okay. I guess it would be kind of hard to uh, account for the AI doing it, because they would probably default to leashing people. Or they, yeah, they'd just be, like, hucking people around with no, not really knowing what to do, or they'd screw up, they'd screw up your attempts at, at, at skill shots. And that wouldn't be fun, yeah. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be more frustrating than helpful. But yeah, it really seems set up, the whole plot seems set up so that you could have two-player co-op and you both have a leash. That'd be cool. It's a real shame. I wonder if there would have been, like, way. leash combos you could do. Yeah. Well, you can you can do co-op and like I said, there's like a co cooperative arena mode in the now defunct online game play. Yeah. Um, and... <laughs> uh oh, you got it on me, Justin. 
Ooh, the wheel has tasted blood now. Yeah, you fed it. At least it's before midnight. Uh. Did you click something? No. Click what? Alright. Alright. And. Word. You get in there. See, and... see, like, I wonder if you. Like, in this old co op, if you had leashed somebody and they leashed the same person, could you have, like, pulled apart and, like, done, yeah, like, a weird like... leash combo thing? I wonder if there's, like, yeah, I wonder if, like, there's some, like, there's some unused skill shot called, like, Wishbone or something like that. That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, let's see. <laughs> see, now we got some dialogue that we missed last time. They're po they even point out to Gray, this is not a very good idea, probably. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I I would definitely question uh, what somebody who would be going around destroying where you are, the building you're in, to move forward. Doesn't seem very good. Doesn't seem like a good idea. Okay, so there's here's, a checkpoint. This is this is where we ran into that dimensional portal in the last episode and fell into the ineffable void. Right. Yoink! Alright. We definitely got him this time. <laughs> there it go! The wheel is loose! Shoot her! <laughs> Shoot her! Okay, now this is what's supposed to happen. You know, that's probably part of it is Trish is supposed to leap off before you, and she can't when she's not there. Oh. And... Oh, again with the rope burn. Oof. Well, he is wearing fingerless gloves, but... Yeah, this is what's supposed to... And remember, this is that platform that I got stuck on, or sometimes inside of. Right, yeah. So you are supposed to be able to actually get on it and interact with it at one point. That makes sense. So confused by, um, Oh, there she goes. <laughs> uh oh. And we're getting we're heading into troubled waters. Yes. Nice to say. Act four, chapter one, the only way through. Oh, so we're we're done with Act three. Yeah, I've I've told you the acts in this are kind of arbitrary. So weird. It actually makes me wonder if there was stuff on the cutting room floor. Yeah, that's a good that's a good point. That's a good point. Jennifer Hale's uh, refuge in audacity is throwing me for a loop. Refuge in vul it, it, in vulgarity rather, not audacity. It is, it, it is unusual to hear her talking like that. Yeah. yeah. Are you pause away from what I'm trying to no, figure out why no, you why you are in the gameplay are pausing oh no I want here we are and well we're okay pretty much is he waterproof I, I guess so seems that way are your guns waterproof yeah as far as I can tell Hmm. Yet you still reek like sun-baked asshole. 
And who wrote this script? I don't know. It's not that there aren't funny bits, it's just like... Like, I know what they were going for, like, using so much vulgarity that it wraps around to being ridiculously funny, but I don't think oh, they okay, got okay. there. Okay, Trish, Trishka said something about the creeps uh, took her leash. It's got her dad in it. Oh, okay. So she, but again, my suspicion is that possibly in the in an earlier version of the script that line wasn't originally she didn't lose it. Okay. Because it's just kind of a here. I mean, it's just sort of a throwaway line, throwaway line establishing that she doesn't have it. To explain why she's not leashing people. Yeah. So that's not part of the story. You're not gonna go get her leash back. No. No, it doesn't really come up. I think that's just to explain why she doesn't when we took. We took our leash off of one of her fellow comrades. Well, I would assume, like, if she saw that you had it, she'd demand yours. But, you know. Yeah, but I, I, I've, I, I've got crazy Mecha Ishii on my side. That's true. Well, more or less on my side. He's neutral with a small, with a slight inclination towards you. Yeah, basically. Yeah, we're in a we're in an urban area. Oh, we can unlock the charge shot for the uh, headhunter sniper rifle. Hmm. Not that we'll be getting much use out of it, but now, didn't I see yeah. you pick up the shotgun earlier? Yes, I did. Okay, I already have the shotgun. Cool. There, there it is, actually. Nice. Um, I have a recurring problem when I was recording this of forgetting which button I had. The weapons are mapped to your. Uh, on the console version, they're mapped to your D-pad. Right. And I key, I had a recurring problem with forgetting which was mapped to where. I see. So, you'll see me. Okay, now here's see these things. Yeah. Hit those. It's on his head now, and I can just. Okay, yeah. They they spray out all these like deadly spores. Oh, okay. Or I think or. So if we can knock them towards guys. They, ha they have they have a talent for homing in on people's heads. <laughs> yeah, they seem to track actually. Yeah. I'm fairly impressed. I think in another life, Grayson could have been uh, quite the soccer player. Yeah, Gr Gray's just that good at kicking. He's he like he's 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 like that guy in Wanted, except instead of bullets, he, he can bend. He can bend it like Foot Beckham. Oh god! Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> He has leg-based psychokinesis. Maybe that's... Well, I mean, he, we already know he can, his kicks can, like, send people slowed down through time. So. Yeah, that's true. He's got the skill shot nominated. I don't recall exactly what that is. Yeah, I don't know what that means, nominated. Uh, I'm pretty sure I, I may need it. I'm not sure. I, th I think I may actually die at one point in unleash the thumper. Yeah. Also, actually, as a point of advice, if you're at a point, any point in this game where it says, it, 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 you know, it has the uh, tutorial mention thing about, you know, this, you can unleash the thumper, it usually means it is a pretty good place to unleash the thumper. So. <laughs> Go back to Pandora. 